All right, y'all, welcome back to Philly D's Garage. So today I got my uh, Coleman PowerMate 1850 um, generator. So I'm just gonna change my air filter real quick. Um, and they sent me an uh, air filter already, but it was the wrong one. So I had to get another one. So I just got it in the mail. So this is what I'm using right here, Briggs and Straighten. It's a new one. And they got a pre-filter in there also, which is right here. Same brand, Briggs and Straighten. So we're gonna pop it off real quick. Got two eight millimeter screws in there. There's your pre-filter right there. So definitely gotta change that. Super dirty. And here's the main filter right here. Which is also super dirty. All right, so first thing you wanna do is match your filters up. Make sure they're the same thing. Okay, both sides is the same. You're gonna pop that back in there. Same as that way you took the other one out. Then you wanna get your pre-filter. And you wanna put that in the same way, so this side out is what they want. So this should be the side out. Slide it back in there. Make sure your screws is in there. Get your gun or your screwdriver. to be too tight so that's how you do it that's how you change your air filter on your power mate 1850 if you like it hit the like button hit the share button and i'll check you guys on the next one